届けたいこの愛この恋 I never thought in a million years that I would be here in Japan singing the music that my grandmother introduced me to. I'm a testament to say that no matter how big your dreams are, they can definitely be achieved. えー、僕の本名が、えー、ジェロームホワイトなんですけども芸名は、えー、ジェロで、えー、演歌歌手をしております。演歌 is a form of Japanese music, so it's only sung in Japan. It is considered an older genre of music. I call it Japanese blues because all of the lyrics are very sad, melodramatic. They often talk about lost loves and heartbreak. It uses a lot of imagination. It really doesn't spell out the meaning of the song for you. So, everyone who listens to the music can have their own interpretation. I was born and raised in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. My grandmother, she was originally from Yokohama. I basically went to my grandmother's house just about every weekend. She listened to Enka music all the time. I think it was a way for her to keep Japan in her heart, even. While she was living in the US. I started singing around five years old. My grandmother would always say, You sing so well. Just to see a smile on her face would just brighten my day because I, I loved her so much. Because I had so much love for Enka and wanted to know what the lyrics I was singing meant, I started studying Japanese in high school and throughout college. I was always interested in Japan and where my mom and my grandmother came from, so I moved to Japan to become an Enka singer. The very first time I stood on the stage and sang for a crowd was actually on TV. Kind of like American Idol. I was given so much praise and it made me feel really, really good. They were just so surprised like, why would a 20 something American be listening to a genre like this? And it kind of worked in my favor. I started singing professionally in 2008. There's never been an American who's been on stage singing Enka professionally here in Japan. I've had the opportunity to do different types of songs, children's songs, musicals, TV dramas. I think I've been really embraced wholeheartedly from the Japanese audience. Me singing Enka really was a way for me to connect to Japan and connect with my grandmother. And to this day, the love I have for Enka has not changed. Thank you.